My name is Howard Dauber and I'm running to be Labour's candidate for the City and East constituency of the London Assembly. I'll tell you a story about something I did last year. I spent a day at the Tower Hamlets Food Bank and I was talking to people about why they'd ended up in Britain in the 21st century having to go to a charity to ask for food to get them through the week. And I met a man who was suffering from the bedroom tax and I asked him, why are you here? And he said, I'm a single man, I live in a two-bedroom flat and I've had my housing benefit cut by the Conservative government. And I said, why don't you move into a, a one-bedroom flat? That's what they want you to do. That's the idea. And he said, I'm a divorced dad. By court order, I get to see my kids at the weekend, but only because I've got a room that they can stay in. So my choice is, do I see my kids or do I have the extra money? Or do I move into a single flat? And it was a no-brainer for him. He had to see his kids. What that meant was he saved up during the week. He had proper food at the weekend with his children. But the rest of the time he couldn't afford to feed himself. And he ended up at the Tower Hamlets food bank. That's why this government and the budget that was announced yesterday is continuing what I think is a mean-spirited uh, and pernicious uh, attack on our welfare system. I'll give you some examples. In East London, one in three kid li kids live in poverty. One in three kids living in a household where mum and dad can't afford uh, to get a proper meal on the table at the end of the day. Where mum and dad can't afford to take kids on hol holiday. Where if something breaks uh, or if there's an accident, then savings are wiped out. And in those sort of households, every penny counts. So when the Chancellor says that for families earning less than £30,000 a year, if they've got more than two children, he's going to cut the child tax credit for the third child. That means an income cut for those families of £65 a week. And with the total uh, benefits cap coming down from th uh, £26,000 uh, by £3,000 to just uh, £3,000, that means thousands of families across East London in Tower Hamlets, in Newham and in Barking and Dagenham are facing a housing benefits cut. Now, who would vote for that sort of budget? Who would vote for a manifesto that contained £12 billion of non-specific welfare cuts? Zach Goldsmith. Zach Goldsmith is the likely Tory candidate for mayor, and yet, through the whole of the last parliament, he voted for every single measure put forward by the coalition government. And you watch this week as Zach Goldsmith troops through the lobbies to vote in favour of the budget that was presented by George Osborne yesterday. Zach Goldsmith voted for that that bedroom tax four times. So let's not have Zach Goldsmith in City Hall in May next year. Let's have a Labour mayor and let's have people at the GLA who will fight to expose what the Conservative government is doing to our communities in East London and will work against these pernicious and mean-spirited cuts. I'm Howard Dauber and I'm standing to be your Labour candidate for the City and East constituency of the London Assembly.